Hey, CW transfers. It is Friday. I don't know about you, but I'm super excited. It's Friday so that I can get some homework done. Other than my date with Canvas, I wanted to chit chat with you a little bit about on campus student employment. I have the great pleasure of meeting Lindsay Grote with student employment uh, via email this past week. And she sent me this amazing PowerPoint and I wanted to share it with all of you. This is where the CW Student Employment Office is located. Phone number and email. Website. And then some more information. So I, for example, work for the CW Transfer Center. I'm a peer ambassador and it is a student employment position. I work no more than about 18 hours per week. Some weeks I work less, especially times like finals week or midterms. That's the great piece about that is this point that Lindsay makes about supervisors willing to work with your school requirements and flexible schedule. I think that's one of the biggest benefits for me having a student employment position here at Central is that flexibility for when I have midterms or finals or a huge paper, or even if I have something going on in my personal life as I am a non-traditional student, I'm married and have children. So sometimes life happens. So this flexibility is amazing. Um, talked about hours per week, saving gas by walking to work. Obviously right now with the pandemic, I am working from home. So I'm saving a lot, but looking at going forward when we're on campus again, it is very easy to take central transit to campus or walk to campus. And I don't have to pay for parking or spend money for gas. Lots of training. It's been wonderful. Lots of resources, lots of additional skills, building my resume. I've met a lot of people, made a lot of connections. Some of those connections led to uh, grad school application references and then scholarship references. So keep that in mind too. Move a little more quickly through this. So student employment eligibility, Lindsay sent me this. So undergrad students, half time is six to 11 credits, 15 weeks, 15 hours per week or approximate. And then grad students, and then going into full time undergrad, which is if you're 12 credits or more, then there moves up to that 20 hours per week. So if you have any other questions about eligibility, you can ask Lindsay or anyone in the office there about these different requirements, eligibility to work on campus. Background checks. So this goes over the background checks that CW will do. I-9 materials ready. These are the different IDs that you're going to need to have readily available for when you do get hired for an on-campus position. And here's the different links. Lindsay included this too. Some of you may be thinking about student employment and wondering if you are job search ready. So resume, cover letter, elevator pitch, prepare that for when someone asks you what your interests are, what you're majoring in, why are you looking for employment? And then practicing some interview responses. Career Services here at Central has some amazing workshops in regards to resume, cover letters, interview prep, etc. So that would be a good resource for you as well. And then needing some help. We just talked about Career Services. So here's another list. They're in Bouillon Hall. Right now they have a lot virtual on their uh, webpage. 
including workshops on resumes and cover letters, counseling, maybe you haven't quite chosen a major yet, or you're looking to get into grad school. So here are a bunch of different resources that they have. And again, if you go to the Career Services webpage, you will see all of that listed. And then where do you look for jobs? So on campus job board, you're gonna to go to your MyCWU, go to the student tab, student employment, and then on campus jobs. What about off campus jobs? Again, MyCWU, student tab, student employment, and then off campus jobs. And then here's some additional student employment. Looks like they have a Facebook page. That's something I didn't know. Gonna make sure I add that. And then you can monitor job postings. Lindsay did say that they have some job postings that'll be coming up for spring quarter. So keep that in mind if that's what you're looking for. And that was our presentation that Lindsay Grote gave to us to help students at Central if they are looking into student employment. Hope everyone has a great weekend. Go Wildcats.